President Eisenhower now felt he had no choice but to call on the Army and Werner von Braun. Though he was against the use of a military rocket, the public and the press were desperate for an American success. And Werner von Braun said that his rocket was ready to go. Good morning, gentlemen. Be seated, please. I have a very important announcement for you. We've been assigned the mission of launching a scientific Earth satellite. I promised the Secretary of the Army that we would be ready in 90 days or less. Let's go, Werner. For years, they had begged for this chance. But to put up a satellite within the deadline would require an unparalleled crash program. This is a rebuilt Redstone, a 200-mile missile, carrying, instead of a warhead, the Explorer. A six-foot bullet, only inches across, crammed with electronic gear. 30 pounds of payload. Cape Canaveral, Florida. Friday, 31 January, the weather is clear. General Medeiros orders launch at 10.30 that night. The Explorer 1 satellite is carefully fitted into place, like a glittering jewel in a metallic set. Okay, check the utility room fuel papers and notify the blockhouse when we're clear to start generator. The beams of powerful searchlights light up the missile. Truly the star of one of the greatest suspense dramas of our time. Close the blockhouse doors. Close the doors. We're counting. It's T minus 35. Man your stations. No talking, please. Countdown to explore a one. Okay, we'll start now. Right, right, the next assembly two is right. AFMCC Charlie Mitchell Charlie Mitchell Charlie Mitchell People were crying there after it finally went up, and, and you were hearing everybody yell, go, 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 you know, as it got farther and farther, and then it got dimmer and dimmer. The rocket just grew dimmer and dimmer, and it was gone. President Eisenhower says that he's been informed that we have successfully put a satellite into orbit. Americans stand a little straighter. They walk a little more confidently. America was finally in the race and took a moment to celebrate. 